St Francis Hospice near Romford, aiming to enhance the lives of some 4,000 people a year affected by any life-limiting condition. It has a 22-bed inpatient unit, but the majority of its work involves caring for patients in their own homes. Even though the patient's at home, they can access all of the services that a patient could if they were actually admitted as an inpatient here. So there's a team of um, different professionals. We've got physiotherapists, occupational therapists, complementary therapists, the medical team, and a patient can be seen by all of those professionals. Its day centre activities are designed to inspire and encourage people like Roseanne, who enjoys the benefits of hospice care alongside her home life. I really look forward to my Wednesdays coming here. Uh, I get the opportunity to do things I would never normally do at home, so it's time for myself. Um, and you get to mix with other people in a similar position, um, and you can offer each other help and advice. It's grown beautifully on the back. Relying on the support of 800 volunteers and charitable donations, St Francis Hospice provides its services free of charge, taking an holistic approach to patients' well-being. It's nice. I haven't had my hair done for a long while because I've not had any. <laughs> People with a wide range of conditions come here for the day. Chris has motor neurone disease. And my wife a break for a few hours. They're not there just to nurse you. They listen to you. And more important, I have a laugh with them. They have a great sense of humour. And St Francis says its commitment to at-home care helps primary care trust too by keeping down costs. We work alongside any other um, community teams that are involved with the patient's care. Um, we can respond rapidly to requests for patients that want to be at home, i.e. hospital discharges. Um, we support these and that frees up beds at the hospital. Keith was given just days to live, but he's enjoying a new lease of life, supported by St Francis' specialist palliative care team. Its nurses make over 5,000 home visits a year, around the clock. Being able to receive telephone support, pain relief, physio and complementary therapy at home keeps Keith close to his loved ones. And that is a real benefit, to think that you're at home with your own family is, is absolutely excellent. Introducing the services from St Francis Hospice, working with the district nurses and the GPs, who are the primary carers in the community. I think we've changed uh, and turned Keith's life around completely. Well, the feeling that you actually get inside is to know that somebody else is there, that if there's a professionals that actually know and can help you. That is, that, that is the biggest thing out of the lot. You know, it, is, it really is magnificent. I, I cannot speak highly enough of them. Supporting people of all ages through difficult times, St Francis Hospice prides itself on over 25 years of care for its community. It's believed that though some conditions may be life-limiting, life itself can and should be lived to the full.